This bill represents one of the education proposals Governor Reynolds laid out in her condition of the state address earlier this month. House Study Bill 64 would prohibit Iowa school districts from using a voluntary diversity plan to prevent open enrollment. Five lower income districts, including Des Moines, have voluntary diversity plans. They give districts the right to block wealthier families from enrolling their students in another district. Des Moines schools have argued they prevent concentrated poverty, but supporters of the GOP sponsored bill say it lifts a big barrier to school choice. Really, it's about parental choice, you know, giving the parents a choice to allow them to move their, school, their children to a different school or one that fits their child in a better way. Democrats and groups like the NAACP are joining DMPS in opposition, saying diversity plans create opportunities for all. Having that opportunity, and that's not just an opportunity for white students or black students or other students of color. It's an opportunity for all people to learn how to work and live together. The NAACP calls it a walk back in time. These uh, bills could potentially finance a cycle where we're actually stepping back into segregation, where wealthier families can actually free public schools. But supporters see things differently. What we hear is that we're going to hurt the diversity of the school, but what about the individual student? What about the parent uh, that says, my child doesn't do well in this school for whatever reason? Why are we why are we really hurting that child? The bill passed the House Education Committee Tuesday. Its next step would be a full House vote. At the State House, Chris Gothner, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.